All right, what's up everybody? My name's Chad. You probably already know me because you're subscribed to Charleston Car Videos. But today we just had this truck come in that we purchased and uh, it is a 1999 GMC SLE. Doesn't that sound nice, GMC SLE? So anyways, we're gonna go take this GMC truck out for a drive real quick. But I thought before we did, let me show you a few cool cars we got. We got this new little Beetle back here that just came in, really neat. We got a Toyota Supra 2021 model, really cool. We have a classic Corvette. And then right here behind me, the Acura, actually not an Acura, a Honda NSX. The reason why it's not an Acura is Acura is American. This is actually Japanese, it's JDM. It's right-hand drive. So we got the Honda NSX, then we got the Buick GS. All kinds of exciting stuff here today at Southern Motor Company. Um, we have some really cool inventory that's flowing in right now. Some of the, probably some of the hottest pre-owned cars in low country. I'm not just saying that because I'm trying to get you excited about cars. I'm saying that because it's the truth. I mean, here's a, here's a M6, beautiful CTS. Got a Can-Am Pontiac right here. Look at that. Okay, I mean, is that not cool? Of course it is. But today's video is about this one right here, the 99 GMC SLE 2500 series long bed. So stay with us, we're gonna take it for a drive, see how it does, and talk about it. A very clean truck, by the way. I mean, this thing is absolutely immaculate. Uh, paint looks good. Front bumper. I mean, you got the North Carolina plate on the front. First in flight. Is that not cool? Wow. Headlights. I mean, it's a beautiful truck. And uh, that's cool, too. We bought both of these around the same time frame. But uh, we bought this at the GAA Classic Car Auction up in uh, North Carolina. So what we got here is a 99 GMC Sierra 2500 SLE, clean Carfax, North Carolina truck, almost its whole life, factory, 7.4, 454 engine, automatic trans, all power options at work, 123K actual miles, power driver seat, almost all original truck, completely no rust, runs out perfect, nothing funny, very hard to find with 454 engine killer piece to have i love it that's cool anyways and uh, that's the truth it probably is a killer piece to have so let's go ahead and hop in the killer piece here and see how it is wow you know just to find one of these this clean it's not easy but we're gonna hop in it's hot today now there is one little thing with it that we got to get checked out and we're gonna check it out right now we're gonna crank it up she's alive now, earlier today when I got in, the AC wasn't blowing too cold, um, and that was a concern of mine, but we're going to run it down the road real quick and see how it does. Got the books, got the manuals, even got a back seat back there. Let's see how this, how this little puppy runs today. But we're going to have to go 255 air with it because the AC is not blowing cold. We're going to have to fix that. And uh, I'm not going to burn myself up in here riding down the road in this truck with no AC. So I got to at least have my windows down. But we're going to cruise it down the road a mile or two and see what we can do. I mean, this is definitely a clean one for sure. Ugh. So far, feels pretty good. Now, what I'm doing on these test drives when we get these vehicles in that we just bought at auction is I'm making sure that it runs out well. No funny stuff. It says that on the window there, no funny stuff. So far, pretty good. I mean, it definitely got the long bed in the back, as you can see back there. 
And uh, I mean, it rides like a 99 GMC Sierra. We definitely need to get the AC work going because it's just too darn hot. My seatbelt on. Hang on. There we go. Let's give it some gas. Not bad. Feels pretty good. Big truck driver. It's a nice cruiser for sure. I mean, it's a nice, clean pickup here. Uh, somebody could buy it and use it as a work truck if they wanted to, but it's probably going to have a pretty, pretty good size price tag on it, just for the condition that it's in. But we're not going to price it so high where it's going to knock your head off, you know. All right, we're going to pull in at the Exxon and uh, grab us a soda pop, or probably some water, and then we'll head on back down to the dealership. Yeah, I definitely need me some water. Don't hit me. Let's see if this needs a little gas in it. Yeah, we got a little, we're getting kind of low on gas, but um, we'll, we'll hook that up a little bit. Stay with us. All right, y'all, I figured while we're out here, why not go ahead and take a look at this pretty truck and look under the hood. 7.4 liter Vortec under here. I mean, that's a big old motor, boy. Look at that big old motor. That's gonna get the job done on a given day of the week. I mean, this will definitely do what you need it to do. But uh, the 454 7.4, I mean, wow. Wait, it's clean, runs good, looks good. I mean, at the end of the day, this is probably what some of y'all are actually looking for out there. And you're not always gonna find it because to find a truck like this from back in 99 this clean it's just not going to be easy to find you know that's what it's all about at the end of the day when we sell cars and all we want to find stuff that's just a little bit you know more unique now uh the hood right now is not wanting to lock down all the way let's try this one more time there we go you just got to manhandle it a little bit and you'll be just fine but we got this one up in north carolina and uh, tires are in good shape. You got your hand cooks on there. Plenty of tread. This is definitely the for sale review right now that you're getting to see. And uh, just clean as can be. Glove box, dash is in good shape, headliner, seats. I mean, everything's just pristine. I mean, look at the bed back here, y'all. I mean, look how clean the bed of the truck is. Spray in, wow, it's amazing. Um, I mean, it really is amazing. You got your tow package right back there. That's nice and easy. Drop that down right there. Nice and solid. Look under there, buddy. Look at that. Look how clean she is under there. Very clean, very clean. All right, let's hit the road. Another day in paradise. You even got power seats. Look at this. Man, this clean, everybody. I mean, seriously, wow. That is nice. There we go, let's hop in. I hope you're having a good time with us today on the video channel here, Charleston Car Videos at Southern Motor Company. If you're ever in Charleston, please come on down and see me. All right, so. If you'd like to come on down and, and buy this truck, we're located in North Charleston, South Carolina, Southern Motor Company, 4252 Rivers Avenue. And um, I mean, you're more than welcome to come down and, and check it out, test drive it. You know, if watching the video today is enough enough for you, where you think, you know, Hey, I, I'm gonna I'm buy that truck sight unseen. I can trust those guys do good business. And uh, you know, they got a nice vehicle that they're, they're geez, you got close with that trailer. Um, if you can tell that we do good business and we're gonna take care of you as a customer, definitely, uh, you know, give me a call, talk to me. We got a lot of nice vehicles at our store. And uh, you know, like I said, with the AC system, we're gonna um, get to the bottom of it and we'll make sure it's right. 
we're not going to um, send anybody a vehicle like this without the AC blowing ice cold. So again, just give me a call, talk to me. My name is Chad at Southern Motor Company, 843-277-2983. You can also send me a message on Facebook or comment on the video right here on YouTube or Facebook. But uh, let's hit the road and take her back down to the dealership. Anyways, last part of the video here, just riding down the road. As you can see, we don't have any check engine lights on. Nothing, nothing weird. There's the mileage, 124.933. Um, everything seems to be in place. All right, guys, I'm gonna get down to the store, sell a few cars. It's a Friday, and uh, hopefully, hopefully you enjoyed this one. If so, please hit that like button for me. Let me know what you think. All right, guys and girls, I'll see you on the next vid.